This is Paddy and Rika. And this is Utopia. So, we are quite hungry right now, as you can see, and uh, Namsum uh, kindly invited us for tea. So, let's see if it is at home. Does he open the door? I see oh, someone. Oh yeah, there he <laughs> is. Hello! 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 Uh, I see you've come around for tea. Yeah. Pop in. Oh, sorry, the door closes. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> come in, uh, take a seat. Oh, oh nice. nice. I sit um, here next to the window. I've been doing a bit of cooking. You just get that, that's it. Um, I've been doing a, a bit of cooking. Thought I'd uh, present you with some meal as you arrived on the Utopia server for the first time. There uh, we go. That's um, one for you. Maybe scoop that up. Yep. And the other one. Uh, not quite. Did you get it? Yeah. 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 Success. So we're starting today's meal with a bit of a salad. Oh yeah. Great. Yeah, it's a nice warm day out. It's a lovely day. But what are you two doing here on the Utopia modded Minecraft server? Yeah, we're starting a new series. So the idea is that uh, after rushing into mods on the Visa War server, I thought, no, that's not the way I want to play mods. We want to take it calm and go mod the vanilla route. So uh, we're here on the Utopia server where uh, there are tons of mods and Nemson will tell us about that in a bit, I guess. And uh, we don't want to play with them right away at the beginning. We will just uh, start with uh, basic stuff like biomes of plenty, just exploring the world and um, yeah, seeing what what is here to see because there's so much beautiful things to see. As you can see in this house, this looks really awesome. I guess that that's a uh, furniture mod here that you can see. So yeah, it's more the normal route what you normally see on my channel that uh, I'm not the guy that Yeah, cracks on with modded stuff right away because I don't know a lot about modded stuff and Rika doesn't either so um, We'll go more the route of um, Starting with mods and taking you with uh, that into the adventure and therefore uh, Nemson kindly gave us the opportunity to play on his server so yeah can you tell us maybe something about the server? Uh, the server's been going for over a year. We've got many YouTubers who make videos on the server. Um, there is a, a YouTube network channel which I try and keep up to date with all the playlists of everybody's videos on here. So I'll be putting your videos on there with everybody else's. Um, we go through phases on the server where we take out a load of mods from the mod pack and replace them with another group of mods on a different theme. Uh, we call these bundles. So we have a core mod pack and then we add bundles in. So we play around with the bundles for a bit and then take the bundle out and replace it with a new bundle every once in a while. Uh, at the moment, the current bundle is the Age of Steam. So we're in a, a steampunky style house in the Age of Steam. Uh, if, you, if you want to just come and have a quick look outside, I'll show you around while we're talking. Uh, you can see from out here in the bird bath, that maybe not so much. Um, there's a little steam. Uh, yeah, you could jump out. That would work. Climb down onto my beehives. You see that big airship up there? A big steampunky airship. That looks awesome, I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, a friend of mine's been building that. It's just literally a building project. It doesn't do much. It's pretty much a vanilla building project if you think about it like that. Uh, there's some vines on this end if you don't want to fall. And uh, I've been building this big steampunky bridge place with lots of steampunk builds on it. Um, we're using a lot of steam trains as well, which is a mod in the current bundle called Traincraft that allows us to make steam trains and go on a ride through steam. Um, let me just show you one just to whet your appetite. And uh, that's a little steam train. <laughs> that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> there are much bigger much much bigger Ooh. ones you, you ride on it yeah you can yeah. Uh, you put water in it put coal in it and it then is self-powered um, it's fun but this is the age of steam we're using steampunk building ideas and steam trains to create a world that eventually when the bundle goes out of um, style when we've fed up with it when we've got it we've done enough and we've played with it for long enough we can take the bundle away and uh, put a new world in place um, the, the thing about Utopia is there is an overworld and there are different dimensions. 
This is the dimension that is dedicated to the Age of Steam. So we can close off this dimension and open up a new dimension for the next bundle when that time arises. But we will always have the overworld as sort of like a, a static place where we can all go back to between bundles. And this uh, is the place where we will start playing, so we won't play a lot in the overworld right now. We will start in this Age of Steam and explore here. You can see it all around. It looks super awesome. This is not a man-made tree. It is uh, actually in the mod pack. And there will be lots of stuff that we can explore and find out. There's lots of uh, wonderful, beautiful things to find in these biomes. And also there's lots of hostile, nasty things that will be out to get you. Um, a lot more so than zombies and skeletons and creepers. So watch yourselves, arm yourselves as soon as you can, and you should be good to survive through the hostile nights. Um, but the daytime, you'll see beautiful, beautiful landscapes unfolding before your very eyes. And I wish you all the best of luck. Um, I'll get you some more food, do you a bit of a pack up, so you've got at least the basic equipment to head out into the world, and then you can go and uh, explore for yourselves. Yeah, and that's what we will do in the first episode, so next week we'll start at the spawn of this world and head out into the beautiful world and take you on an adventure with us. So, see you next time. Bye. Bye. See you later, folks.